In this tutorial, we will be reviewing long ultrasound to evaluate for pleural effusion. You will be using either the cardiac or, or phase 3 probe or the curved or abdominal probe to perform this study. To evaluate the right pleural cavity for pleural effusion, you will place the probe in a coronal position very similar to the position you perform for the FAST exam. In the anterior or mid-axillary line, probe marker towards the patient's head. To evaluate the pleural cavity, you will need to move more cephalate towards the patient's head. And you want to evaluate the area just above the diaphragm. So this is the corresponding ultrasound image that you want to try and evaluate. Looking at the lung in this ultrasound image on the right, you'll see that the lung appears very much similar to the liver. And this is because a normally aerated lung does not transmit ultrasound waves. And therefore, when ultrasound waves transmit through the liver, it will hit the highly reflective diaphragm, transmits through the liver, it does not go through a normally aerated lung, and then goes back to the ultrasound probe. Therefore, a normally aerated lung will appear very similar to the liver tissue. This is known as normal mirror image artifact. And this is another example of how a normal lung will appear and it looks very much similar to the liver. This rules out pleural effusion in the right pleural cavity. You will perform the same imaging technique to evaluate the left pleural cavity. The only difference is that you will have to place the probe coronally and more posterior that your knuckles will be touching the bed. And then you will move the probe more syphilate probe marker towards the patient's head. And you will try and interrogate the area just above the diaphragm looking for any signs of pleural effusion. This is the ultrasound image that you will try to obtain. Note that the same technique and the same image interpretation applies here. Note that the normally aerated lung on the left side will appear very similar to the spleen. This is due to the mirror image artifact that was previously discussed. Having this view rules out pleural effusion on the left side.